The United Kingdom is taking threats of foreign interference in elections, expected later this year, very seriously, its defense minister said on Sunday, January 21, after a warning from a counterterrorism official. Obviously, that's something that we take very seriously, Grant Shapps told the Sky News Channel. Counterterrorism bodies and other institutions would be looking very carefully at that. He said. UK counterterrorism chief Matt Jukes said on Friday that the espionage threat from foreign states such as China, Russia and Iran is greater now than it has been since the days of the Cold War. He said the police had set up a new unit to counter the threats of interference ahead of the election, which is expected to be called later this year. The unit would use powers granted by the National Security Act passed last July to make it harder for countries to spy on and interfere in the political process. He said, We are talking about parts of the state apparatus of Iran, China and Russia, Jukes said. A report by United States software company Microsoft in November last year said that Russia Iran and China were likely to engage in sophisticated influence and interference efforts ahead of the 2024 U.S. presidential election and in other pivotal elections worldwide. All three countries were expected to seek to shape geopolitical outcomes in their favor amid major ongoing or potential regional conflicts. The report said. Interference efforts were likely to take place on different online platforms than those targeted in elections in 2016 and 2020. The counterterrorism chief also warned that conflict in the Middle East had led to a surge in extremist activity and that the United Kingdom was facing a radicalization moment. He said there had been a 25% increase in information flowing through police systems about terrorism and violent extremism, a significant increase on usual levels. We always see spikes after terrorist incidents, but what we've seen since October 7 has been a spike which is higher and more sustained than ever before. Jukes said in comments to local media. I would describe the speed and the scale of the impact of those global events as extraordinary.